Just kidding. I'm Gwen, and I'm a scientist. Well, kind of. I help out the scientists at Rothamsted Research. Let me show you what we get up to on our Devon farm. Come on, come on. These scientists, they're kind of obsessed with me. They want to know everything that's going in and everything that's going out. That means everything. They collect these samples to calculate how many nutrients come out of me and how much is lost in the environment. That's Andy. He's collecting soil samples for his research. He'll take them back to the lab. Andy, wait! Can I help? And give it a thorough health check examining how compact it is, checking for beneficial microorganisms. They want to know whether me and my friends and different types of pasture are having an impact on the soil's health. I get to snack on all kinds of grasses here. Permanent pasture, grass white clover, a tasty salad of herbal lay, as well as having different flavors. They also have different amounts of species or biodiversity. I wonder what's on the menu at the cafeteria today. Here comes Deb. She's been recording the different wildlife in the fields. This information tells us how different types of pasture affects biodiversity. Give us a look. <coughs> hey, you didn't put my name down. They've started to grow trees in one of our fields. Silvo pasture, as the scientists call it. They're trying to find out how adding trees to our fields can help me and my friends, farmers and the environment. Right, back home for some treats. I've just got to stick my head in a strange box. In exchange for my burps, I get some really tasty treats. Mm, sugar beets. They're measuring my breath and doing calculations to find out how much methane I'm producing. Speaking of treats, I best get out in the yard again and step on those scales. Oh, I'm dreading this. Oh golly, I've put on a few kilos. We sometimes get to wear some cool accessories. This one also measures the methane I produce. These track where we go in the field throughout the day. And my cow pedometer, or hoofometer, helps see whether different types of grazing are better for grass growth, the soil, and biodiversity. What a day! I am utterly exhausted.